Hey guys, T Max signing in, and today I've actually got my Chelsea top on. You're probably thinking, why the heck am I talking about that? Well, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about some of the coolest, the best, and most of all, some of my favorite kits in FIFA 16. So hopefully you do go on to enjoy this video, as there'll be a variation. I'll probably try a couple of top 10, so hopefully you're going to enjoy that. Right, at the time of making this video, I actually don't have a kit I use as my main kit on all my team. I just use the default kits I've been given. I actually don't know what kit to go for as well, so by the end of this video, I'll really appreciate it. If you can leave a comment telling me which kit out of the kits I'll be talking about I should use. Starting us off we have the UNAM team. Now, I think the team's called the Panthers UNAM or UNAM Panthers not too sure which one but the kit looks pretty sexy. It's yellow blue and we've got that big panther slap bang in the middle. Looks really cool the colors really go together the yellow blue like I said I like the look of it and I'm pretty sure at some point I'll probably try this kit out because it does look pretty cool and if you're a person that likes to impress your friends with kits this is definitely one to go for next we have the Aguilas Dorados kit probably shouldn't have put it on a gold backdrop but nevertheless the cool looking kit I like gold kits and I'm pretty sure there's some of you out there that like gold kits as well and if you're that kind of person this is the kit to go for it's actually got some diagonal lines going down it they're like darker gold lighter gold lines it looks cool and it's definitely a kit to use if you're a person who likes gold kits like myself now here we have the foot icebreaker kit now this is pretty much one of the hardest kits to get mainly because you get it after you win division one hopefully i'll have this soon but like i said it's not easy to get it's a good kit to get though looks cool black and yellow color scheme going on there if any of you actually have it let me know down in the comment section i want to see how many of you guys actually have it. next we have the jaguars the cordoba kit i think that's the name of the team the kit looks pretty cool if you ask me the colors on that are just insane got like a light blue dark bluish theme going on there look really closely there's a picture of either a tiger or a lion the kit looks really cool if you're considering a kit for me to use by the end of this video definitely put this in your top three because i really do like the look of that and if you're someone who's looking for a cool kit a kit not everyone uses this is definitely a kit to go for because an know team i've not seen a lot of people use it but as you can see there it looks pretty cool now here we have the kv mechelen kit now it's a pretty cool looking kit i know i've seen a few people using it I've seen a few youtube was using it as well i think this way back is the main one that i've seen using this it's a cool looking kit like i said the smiley winky face on the front of it just adds to how good this kit looks the color scheme as well goes really well it's really bright the yellow and reddish pinkish kind of color there looks cool on the kit and it's definitely a kit i would like to try out myself for those people that like bright kits though this is definitely a kit you should consider using now onto a bit of a different kit we have the mori rent kit i think that's how you pronounce the name of the team it's a cool looking kit black gray with a tinge bit of pink on it the pink looks like it's been clawed into the kit by a tiger or something i just like the way it's been done don't really see many kits like this on all my team which is why i put this into the video onto a bit of a retro kit this is a kit you've probably seen in a lot of previous fifas it's the newcastle kit it's not actually called newcastle retro kit but if you were to search for newcastle kit you would see it come up it's one of the retro kits what i really like about this is that old style logo slap bang in the middle of the kit there just adds to it it's not the brightest of kits but the color scheme really goes in previous fifas i actually used this quite a lot so i thought i might as well put it into the video here we have another bright kit it's the patrick thistle kit it's red and yellow and has a nice little image on the front of it i don't know what it is with me this year but i'm really liking kits with interesting or weird kind of images on the front of them and yeah this is just one of those kits stands out looks cool probably look good in game as well and as i don't think a lot of people know about this this will probably be really cheap to get so yeah if you're low on coins looking for a cool kit definitely try this out now here we've got a bad boy kit it's the ray of a carno kit this kit looks op a lot of youtubers use this a lot of people online use it and yeah it's just a pretty cool looking kit which is probably why a lot of people use it i've thrown it into this video because i know most of you guys search for this kit don't know what it's called well that is the team for the kit it's the ray of a kit so if you are looking to purchase it definitely go online and give it a try because it does look cool and you will look cool playing in it next we have the sc here in bean kit hope i pronounced that name right it looks cool it's one of my personal favorites which is why i threw into this video don't really see a lot of people using it probably one of those kits that are underlooked but the style of it's pretty cool it's blue white and has i think hearts maybe even butterflies i'm not too sure what those red things are but they just add to the kit and make it look a little bit different from the average stripy kit and there's no way I can make a kit video without including the Seattle Sounders kit. They look OP. 
they have that Xbox logo on the front which is what most of you guys like. Personally the green and blue one is my favourite. I've actually used this in previous FIFA's and it looks cool. The only downsides on these kits is that they're actually expensive mainly because a lot of people want these kits. Now originally in this video I was going to hit you up with a variation of 10 kits but if you're still watching at this point I thought I might as well show you a bonus kit. This is the kit as you can see there and the team it's used by is called Temporary. I think it's an Argentinian team. Nevertheless the kit looks quite cool. It's black and that blue stripe just puts the finishing touch on it. In game this looks sick and I can't actually wait to try out this kit myself. Once again after seeing all these kits let me know which kit you think I should use. There's a lot to choose from. There's a big variation which is why it's really hard for me to choose. Anyway that's it for this video. Make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed. If we can hit 125 plus likes that would be amazing and if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe if you like FIFA 16 content. As of tomorrow after making this video I'll probably be showing you guys the best badges to use. Literally went out and searched for literally about an hour looking at a variation of badges and I came up with some cool ones so if you want to see that video come back tomorrow. Also if you're not already follow me on Twitter as well if you tweet me with the hashtag team tmac I will follow back. That's about it for today and this is tmac signing out. Thanks for watching guys and see ya. <laughs> This is the end of the video, hard. Yeah. If you enjoy, just comment and subscribe. Yeah. Wanna see more? Don't forget to leave a like. Do it. <laughs> this is T Max signing out.